oil tarred and blackened the sandy shores of Huntington Beach after a massive spill over the weekend. Federal and state investigators on Monday were focusing on the 41-year-old pipeline thought to have sent 3,000 barrels of crude oil into the Pacific Ocean, threatening fish and wildlife. Cleanup crews dressed in white coveralls and helmets worked along the beach south of Los Angeles. Birds covered in oil washed up on shore along with dead fish. The inlet feeds Magnolia Marsh, a rehabilitated wetlands. Officials said up to 90 bird species use the area each year, including some that are either endangered or threatened. An organization dedicated to rescuing animals from oil spills said the disaster had already done damage, although so far the impact has not been as bad as they feared. So to date, we have collected three live oiled birds, uh, one brown pelican, one American coot, and one ruddy duck. Unfortunately, uh, the brown pelican had chronic injuries that required us to humanely euthanize it yesterday. Authorities identified the line under investigation as the San Pedro Bay Pipeline, which connects an offshore oil rig to a site in Eureka, California. The rig and pipeline are operated by a subsidiary of Houston-based Amplify Energy Corporation. Amplify on Monday did not return a call seeking information. On Sunday, its chief executive, Marty Wilshire, said the firm was working to help the cleanup. We are fully committed to being out here for the until um, this incident is fully concluded. Um, we are working collaboratively with the, the Coast Guard, the California Department of Fish and Wildlife, numerous state agencies and the local communities to help with all of the recovery efforts. AccuWeather reported that a coming storm in the Los Angeles area could hamper those efforts.